Yeah. Tell the hoe to come in with her thick ass. In the bag at the bed with my rich ass. Put the fucking jab with this real fast. Then I had to go and cut the eye. Got a new bitch that hoe do Pilates. I'm the dumb bitch, you know I fucking got it. Hey bitch, I think I'm John fucking got it, huh? Bag at the bag with your bitch ass. Tell that hoe to come here down with her thick ass. Bag at the bag with your bitch ass. I think they trying to stick my swag. Ain't shit, man. Chillin', chillin', man. What's going on? Fly money. You already know fly money salute gone. What is Fly Money? Because I don't think a lot of people know. I mean, Fly Money is shit. It used to be a group of us. I mean, now it's just me. I'm just, you know, young Fly nigga, get fly, get money, you know? Regular shit. So, so, so what do Fly Money do? Like, like what, 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 what is their business? I mean, shit. My, my business is to be a, um, the number one entrepreneur. I mean, I'm an entrepreneur, promoter, businessman. Father too, you know. I I do it all, man. Whatever it takes to be get done to get a dollar. I don't steal, I don't kill, but you know, hustling wise. I don't sell drugs either. You know, entrepreneur, electronics, cars, clothes, shoes, whatever you need. Fly money, one stop a shop. So, so I'm glad you said all that. We gonna we gonna start with with uh. You said a few things. You yeah. Said promoter. Yeah. Entrepreneur. Yeah. You uh. You sell electronics? I mean, I sell everything. Food, clothes, shoes, whatever. You, man, fly money, one stop and shop. Ain't, ain't, no, ain't no varies of what you might need. Bundles, hats, a so, white beater, bar of so, soap. I got so it. Let's go back to this, the electronics. All right, I got now, you. Everybody, everybody uh, you know, from what I've seen, you sell a lot of phones, iPhones. Yeah. People have people been, been questioning your, your products, your, specifically your iPhones and, and some shoes. I, I know some people who you sold shoes to that, you know, they come yeah. back to you guaranteed. Yeah. Do you, do you like pick and choose who, who you get or who you don't get or you everything legit? I mean, everything legit, but I, I kind of pick and choose when it comes to phones and shoes and shit because motherfuckers be so goddamn, everybody want to live that high life, that top dollar life, but they ain't got the funds for it. If the store charge 800, I'm charging 400 shit. Why not shop with me? Why you gonna go to the store and spend the eight when you saving the whole four? All the phones legit, all the shoes legit, like everything A1. Nothing fake, B grade, I ain't got no clone, iPhones, everything. Unlock the any company, everything official, man, everything. I'm I'm uh, stamp that. Everything official. Everything official. Everything. Okay. Okay. So uh so so let's go to this uh promoter. How how did you start promoting? And where you, where would you say from where you started to where you at now? Tell, I'm, me, tell me, tell me the, the the progression, the degression, if it was any, and, and where you at now? I mean, when I first started promoting, goddamn, my homeboy put me on to the shit. Like he wanted to throw a birthday party, goddamn, Cedric, you know, say Montana. He was like, man, shit, everybody know you. I figured I should put the money up and you know you promote the shit. So that all started off. It started off probably like in 2013, 14. I promoted my first party for him, you know, it was my face, but his funds, I promoted and the shit was swole, like the shit was packed, everybody was there, so from then I just, I ran with it. I mean, when I first started doing it, man, I ain't even gonna lie, it seemed like I could pack a motherfucking club, I'm talking about shoulder, shoulder, wall to wall, and now it just seemed like, I mean, I ain't hating on nobody, throwing no shots at nobody, but everybody doing it. Everybody want to throw parties, and it seemed like when I threw my shits, from when I was throwing my shits, it wasn't no hate. Now I'm I threw a party motherfucker just hate or envy what I'm doing or what I got going on. Why? I, I don't know. Maybe they envy me. Uh, what the case scenario might be. I figure. I feel like the promotion shit decreased. It did. It decreased from from when I started to for, to right now. Okay. Okay. So uh, during during the time you're promoting, who, who, who how many people? When Fly Money was at its top. How many people you think was on your team? Man, shit. I mean, the we had promoters and we had a team. It probably was like ten, maybe fifteen of us. But shit, I was the only one motherfucking putting in all the work. 
Honestly. Okay. So, so, what you say the best, the best party, fly money, had? Man, when me and Khalil had that um pre-summer bash at Brass, man, that bitch was swole wall to wall, lying outside, lying all by the elephant at Brass Elephant. That shit was crazy. That was the package one. I ain't lying. The worst party ever was all right. The worst party ever was when I did a party with the um with the Q dogs from Claflin. I think he was a Q up alpha. I don't know which fraternity he was in, but man, that shit was terrible, like terrible, terrible. But then after that, it was the Jacques party. Woo! That shit was crazy, man. I ain't that shit was it was crazy, crazy. So, so, I know a lot of people wondering about that party. What, Jacquees one? I, I'm not even going to ask you about it. I'm just let you explain if you feel you need to explain. Yeah. If you want if you want to tell the people exactly what happened from your mouth, not through no Facebook status, but right here on camera, on wax. Yeah. About the situation. You can't. Man, I already had put up the ten paid for the club and everything, ten thousand to be exact. Paid fifteen down there, seventeen hundred for the club, paid the promoters and all that shit. And shit, my partner, he was like shit. Last minute he was like shit, man, I ain't paying no ten more thousand for this nigga. He ain't worth ten thousand, so shit. Shit went from goddamn sugar to shit. And I was like, shit. I ain't got ten more thousand. So shit, that's that's the true story, man. Honestly. So, so what what about what about uh so you saying ten thousand paid. Yeah. To Jacquees. Ten thousand. You got ten thousand dollars. Man. You paid for the club, that's what you say in, in promoters and all that. Yeah. Alright, so The night came. Ticket sales. From from my understanding, you you get the back end plus before the AFC time. Most of the time, you get that. Yeah. Sometimes the night of you might pull through, but most of the time, the ticket sales. What what what, what was what was that like? Man, I'm, to be honest, the event was hyped up like this. I thought the shit was gonna be blow, man. I ain't lying. I thought the shit was gonna be everything, but shit, the night of the ticket sales and the back end, which was the other ten thousand, ain't had really got down. Whoop whoop, ain't had it didn't match. So I mean, I wouldn't be mad at my nigga for them for backing out. Shit, I wish I could have backed out, but shit, I can't even be mad. The ticket sales did not meet meet the back end. I mean, shit, I hollered at Jacquees some boys. I was like, shit, man. I got a couple of dollars. You could at least do a walkthrough, let the people know that you here. This, that, and third. This nigga, he was so goddamn arrogant, cocky. He ain't even want to do nothing. He ain't want to take no picture with me. He ain't want to come to the club. Goddamn, do a little Michael Jackson move on the floor like he usually doing his videos. He ain't want to do nothing. He ain't had that 10000 The nigga barely wanted to talk. Like, it was over it. He got ten whole three thousand dollars, basically. Okay. So, so that's the Jacque situation. That's that's it, man. Anything else that you're hearing? That's it. I mean, take it or leave it. That's what really happened. I mean, I was gonna throw a free party and shit, but I was like, man, fuck it. Shit, y'all already bashing me enough on it on social media, so I'm like, what I'm giving y'all something back for? Ain't no need.